kids, why don't you go pack up your stuff? We're moving today. Come on, Mom. We're not kids, okay? Yes, get out of our case. Kennedy, don't give us that attitude. I mean, seriously, Ken yeah, Kennedy, Teresa, Fortis, don't give us that attitude. And get off the countertops. How many times did your mother and I need to tell you to not sit on the countertops? That's not what they're for. Fine, I'll get off. Kennedy, what is, what is up with this attitude? I mean, seriously. We did not raise you to be like this. Whatever. Oh my god. I just got a text message from my friend Lisa. I need to go to the mall right now. You are not going anywhere. We are packing up and leaving. Yeah, so go into your room and pack up your stuff. We're not going to tell you again, Amanda. Seriously, this is so stupid. Why are we moving? Seriously, I've told you this a thousand times, Amanda. We're moving to New York City because I got a new job. And from where we live right now, that's just too far to commute back and forth. I just don't have the time and energy to, to do that. And plus, I don't have the money to do that. Fine. We'll go pack up our stuff. Come on, Kennedy. Ugh. Don't give us that attitude, girls. And where's your sister? We don't know. She she's in the bathroom. Yeah, she's she's been crying in the bathroom all day. Oh my god. I'm gonna go see what's up with Leo. Alright. Leo, are you okay in there, sweetheart? Go away, Dad. I don't want to talk right now. <laughs> Honey, I know you're upset about us leaving Fremont, but... We have to, okay? It's... I, I just can't... I, I wish there was some way that we could stay, but I, I just don't have the time, energy, and money to commute back and forth that far. I'm gonna have to leave my friends, my best friends that I grew up with for years! I know. I know, and... But, honey, look at the bright side. You'll make all new friends in New York City. I don't want to make new friends, Dad. I want my old friends. What if I make new friends and forget about them? And what if they make new friends, too, and they forget about me? Well... I know you're afraid of that, but, honey, that's not going to happen. If they're truly your best friends, they're not going to forget you. And you're not going to forget them. <laughs> honey. Honey, please come out of the bathroom. Right, fine. <laughs> Honey, I, I know, I know. <laughs> I know, I know. I know you're upset. I know you're sad. But 
Everything's gonna be fine, okay? <laughs> All right, come on, just get in your. What the hell, bones? Oh, hi, Dad. Don't hey, Dad, me. Look at this. Your room is a your. Look at this! Your room is a disaster! We're moving today! Yeah, we know, Dad. Amanda, get up off your bed! Seriously, I... We cannot... We cannot leave this house with... With your stuff scattered everywhere. Pick this up! I'll be in here in a few minutes with a few boxes so you can start putting stuff in them. Jesus. So you finally decided to come out of the bathroom today? <sighs> Katie, shut up! <sighs> hey, I. <sighs> hey, none of this shut up business, okay? We don't say shut up in this family, Leo. Well, she started it. I don't care. No, here's some boxes. Start packing up your freaking crap. I'll be back in here, and I swear to God, everything better be in these boxes by the time I get back in here. Or you're going to be in serious trouble. Fine, whatever, go, Dad. And Amanda, no, Amanda, get up off your bed. I, how many times do I have to tell you that? Get off my case, Dad. All right, you know what? If you keep up that attitude, you're not going to be doing anything when we get to New York City. All right? You'll be stuck in the house. What do you think of that? Alright, fine. This sucks. Yeah, you're telling me. I, I don't understand. Why us? Why do we have to move? You don't know, Leo. Amanda, Dad said to get up off the bed. Fine, fine. I'm, I'm getting up. Jeez. Why are you being so rude? I didn't say anything to you or do anything to you. Yeah, well, I'm sick of everybody just... <clears throat> Real nice, Amanda. Oh, shut up, Kenny. Hey, Dad said not to say shut up. We don't say shut up in this family. Just, just get out of here. Just get out of here, Leo, and continue packing. You girls better be packing in there. We are, Dad. You know, you could help, Amanda. I was helping you, idiot. Hey, don't say that. That's really hurtful. Who, who said, who, okay, who, who just, who just called somebody an idiot in here? Amanda called me an idiot, Dad. 
Amanda. What? What, Dad? Why'd you call your sister Leo an idiot? Because she was screaming at me saying that I wasn't helping. When I clearly was. Well, yeah, well, looks like you're almost done, so keep it up. And look, I'm, I'm sorry I was screaming at you and getting mad, okay? But please do not insult each other. You two, you three are sisters, okay? This is not a good example for your brothers. I mean, seriously. All right, I'm 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 going to talk to your mother. Just get just get the rest of this stuff packed up and put it in the van outside. Okay. Uh, uh, Kennedy, can you come help me with this? Sure. Uh, 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 There we go. I'll pat. <sighs> wow, this is this is really good. All right, um, you can get the stuff loaded onto the van now. Good job, girls. Thanks, Dad. Oh, yeah, this is the life. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Garrett and Steven, get off your lazy bums. Did you get your, did you get your room packed? Did you get your rooms packed up? Yeah, we did a long time ago, Mom. Yeah. Well, get up off your lazy bums. We're we're leaving in just a few short minutes here. All right. Okay, let's get this in. Uh, 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 Junior. <laughs> hey, what's up? <sighs> Don't hey, what's up, me? What are you doing on top of the car? I'm just laying up here. Get down off the car. My mom and dad are going to freak if they see you up there. Oh, come on, Leo. You're just over... You're being overly dramatic about this. I am not. Mom and dad are going to freak. No, they won't. Junior! Junior Fortis, get off the roof of the car! This instant! Yeah, get down! Alright, fine! Jeez. Seriously, Junior, that was real stupid what you did. You, you literally could have gotten yourself hurt. I'm sorry, Mom. I was just trying to play around. Well, Junior, cars are not for playing around with, okay? So, just stop, alright? Yeah, okay, now, let's just get this stuff in the car and, you know, get ready to leave. Alright, Mom. Alright, come on, Leo, get in the car. Um, Mom, wait. Can I please just say goodbye to my friends first? Alright, yeah, you can say goodbye. Just just hurry back r real quick. We don't have much time. Okay. I'll be I'll be right back. Bye you guys. I'm leaving. Oh. Bye. <laughs> We'll miss you so much. Oh, Leo. We'll miss you so 
what? I know. <laughs> but I'll never forget you. Karina, Addison, Stephanie, and Maggie. <laughs> I'll never forget you too, Leo. <laughs> Goodbye, Leo. I'll miss you. Bye. I'll miss you guys too. Bye. <laughs> We'll miss you, Leo. <laughs> <laughs> so, Dad, how long is this drive to New York City? Oh, uh, it's about nine hours and thirty-eight minutes. Ah, uh, don't do that. Yeah, don't groan and. <sighs> Mom, I mean seriously. What are we supposed to do nine hours in the car? I don't know. Talk to each other. You're siblings. Yeah, you're siblings. Why don't you just find something to talk about for the next nine hours and 38 minutes? Fine. All right, we're here. We're here in our new home. Finally! Oh, finally, that was the most, oh my God, that was the most grueling nine hours and 38 minutes we've ever had. Yeah, I'll say. <laughs> All right, well, since we're here, let's start unpacking our stuff and moving our stuff into the new house. Okay, Dad. Hey, Leo, you want to see a slam dunk? Dude, you don't even have a basketball, let alone a basketball hoop. Oh, no, that's why I'm using you. Ah! Junior Clan Fires, get me down from here! Well, come on, I'm just playing around! Junior, quit torturing your sister and help unload the car. Fine. Ow! You're such a dork. I am not, Junior! Hey! Knock it off. That's enough. Help unload the car. And where are your brothers? They're in the... They're in the house already! Oh. Uh, I'm gonna get them. Steven and Garrett, get out here and help unload the car! Yeah, seriously. What? Stephen and Garrett, get down off the countertops. I just got done telling your sister Kennedy that nine hours ago. Well, come on, Dad. We're just having fun. Yeah. We're just doing the splits. I don't care. This is a brand new house, and I don't want you scratching up the brand new countertops. So, get down. All right. So don't help unload the car. All right. Well, I'm done. I'm going to chill. All right, now get yeah, get get over there and help. All right. Okay. What are you going on about? Uh, Stephen and Garrett were up on the countertops, and we specifically told Kennedy the same thing to get off the countertops, like nine hours ago at our new house, our old house. Yeah, Stephen Garrett, what what were you doing on the new brand new countertops? We were just playing around. Uh. You 
know what? I'm, 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 I'm going to take a break. All right. You know, you could help us, Leo, instead of just sitting there on your laptop. Buzz off, Kennedy. I'm, I'm checking my email. Oh, blah, blah, blah. Email, email, email. You're supposed to help us unpack. Yeah. And yet we're doing all the work. This is our room. Yeah. So just get off your lazy bum and help us. All right. Fine, fine, fine. I will help. Now you're happy? That's not unpacking, Leo. You just made a big mess. Yeah. What's your problem? <sighs> My problem is that we had to move away from Fremont, Indiana. All the way to New York City. And I don't have any friends here. I'm so mad right now. I'm really upset. Look, you're not the only one that had to move away from friends, okay? We all had friends back in Fremont, too. Yeah. You're not the only one. We're upset. We're just as upset as you are. Yeah. Yeah, well, it's still not fair. Tell us about it. I can't believe this. We're finally here in our new home. I know. And, honey, I'm so glad we did this. I know. Me too, honey. Hey, Dad? Uh, yeah? Yeah, Stephen, what is it? Um, is it cool if we take the car around town for a little bit? Uh... Yeah, sure. Just make sure you fill up the car with gas on your way out. Okay. I'll do that. Alright, thank you, Steven. Dude, Steven, why are we listening to a girl tune? I don't know. Yeah, dude, turn this crap off. Alright. Let's listen to something cool. Yeah. Let's see what what we wanna do here. Uh oh, this one seems cool. Oh yeah. Yeah, this is awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, this is awesome! Oh yeah! Let's go check on the girls. Alright. Girls, uh... Shh! Mom. Leo's taking a nap. Really? She should be trying to go make friends right now. Yeah, well, you can try and wake her up, but I don't think she wants to be woken up. Alright. Uh, Leo, honey? Mm, what, Mom? I, okay, honey, why don't you try and go outside and make some friends? Uh, Mom, why can't you... Can't you just let me take me? Can't you just let me take a nap today? We've been in the car for nine hours. Honey, come on. Get up. Honey, come on. Get up. Uh, fine. Okay, where to start looking for friends? Hmm. Oh! Oh my 
my god. I'm so sorry. Oh, no, it's okay. I'm I'm sorry. Uh, are you new here? Yeah, I, I just moved here today. Uh, hi, I, I'm Leo Fortis. <laughs> hi, nice to meet you. I'm Megan Brissett. <laughs> you know, it's a funny thing. I actually have a best friend named Leo. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> Me and him, we we do some pretty crazy things together, and yeah. You'll think he's really cool when you get to meet him. Oh, sweet. So, um, I guess, uh, well, where are you from? Uh, Fremont, Indiana. Wow, that's a long way. Yeah, I know. Well, welcome to New York City. Thanks. <laughs> 